Hello guys, this is one two thousand six and welcome to The Wolf Among Us. So this game is a game made by Telltale.com, the creators behind the Walking Dead Telltale game. Uh I played those and holy shit those were great. Season one, two, three, and four. Those were all fucking amazing. But I've never really played The Wolf Among Us. I heard like it is like good like it is one of the good games storytelling games as well so i thought hey let's fucking play it because why the fuck not it's a storytelling game choices matter you know so yeah i'll make choices see what happens we're sticking with it no changes at all. if i fuck up i fuck up so yeah let's get right into it first episode fame Ooh. Smoke and mirrors. Oh shit. A crooked mile. In sheep's clothing and a cry wolf. Hmm. Alright. Well then. Let's start. Starting off with episode one. Faith. This game's series adapts to the choices you make, the story is tailored by how you play. Yeah. Unless it's gonna be like once a once upon a time in a New York City, there lived a community of fairy tale characters known as Fable Town. The fables who lived there arrived hundreds of years ago after they were exiled from homelands. Through the use of magic spell called Glamour, they have protected their secret community from the mundane world. Sheriff Biggity Wolf protects them from each other. Big B, is it? I'm Big B, I think. Dude, I love the fucking art style, though. Oh. The Wolf Among Us. Hmm. Okay. I feel like this is gonna be like some type of jazzy type fucking game. Right? Okay. He does look like a fucking wolf, though. Sometime after midnight. What the fuck? Mr. Toad? Shit. Big B! Listen, mate. Oh, Big B. I know I don't look human. It's a problem, I'll get it. I just stepped out of the apartment for just a second to see what kind of damage this drunk shit is doing. Just cut me a break, yeah? I'll get me glamour first thing in the morning. Cross my arm. No need to kick up a fuss. Hmm. Well, a three foot toad. I'm looking at a three foot toad in a sweater. That's a problem. Yeah, that is a problem. Can't afford to look human. You're going to the farm. It's as simple as that. Damn. You can't send me up to live with those animals. You know what I mean. Go see a witch. Get a glamour. Big B, they're bleeding me dry, mate. The quality of the spell goes down, but the rates keep climbing up. Do you have any idea how much it costs to have an entire family in glamour? Mm. I don't make the rules. I don't make the rules. Sorry. I can't give you a free pass on this, Toad. My hands are tied. Right, right. There's too much at stake. Whatever it costs, it's worth it. But you don't want me catching you out of glamour again. Fucking hell! See? This is what I told you about, Sheriff. You're just gonna stand there 
do something, Big B, before he completely tears up the place. All right, let's just probably go ahead. Fucking go upstairs. Yes, please. Thank you. Yup, you're welcome, Ted. New book of fables entry unlocked. Okay. That was pretty job shite. Tell me how to spend my money. Dad. Oh wow. Are shaking again. What did I say? You want a big bad wolf to take you away? Uh. No. Shit. Then get the fuck back inside. Yeah, you little shit. Get the fuck back inside. Hmm. You're gonna know who I fucking am, you hear me? Ooh, shit. Hey, look at me. Just stop, okay? You're drunk. Let go. What the fuck did I get? A matchbook. Money and a matchbook. Take a good look. You know who I am now? Hey, look at me. There you go, Big B. Doing good. Doing good for the community. Putting the phone up and shit. Alright. Let's see what's in. So aggressive like or calm like? With a drunk man, I'm gonna go calm. Yup. God damn you! Hey, whoa, man. Whoa, 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 hey, hey! You've got something on your face. Fuck are you talking about, you stupid? Hey, man, I'll calm down. Kill you. you fucker! Why'd you hit her, dog? Right, you hit her? Oh! What are you gonna fucking do, huh? Get the fuck out of the way. Right, this is get the axe again. This is your See, last warning, dog. This is your last warning. Come on, man. You keep on like this. I won't have any choice but to put you down. Put yeah, you what down. he said. You got a shit fucking memory, wolf. That's not how it went last time. This oh, you want to bet? Last time. Oh shit. Oh, you see that? I hit that shit. Go, go, go. Gotta calm down. Uh. Oh, shit. Oh. Oh. Dude, I'm a god dodger. Come on. Oh. Yeah. Try and do the safety options. Almost. Stop. I gave you this last warning, dog. Alright. Couch. Had enough? Oh shit. At least it's a fucking challenge. What do you think I'm fucking doing? Oh shit. That, come on. Punch him. Oh. Oh, okay, I guess we're doing the show. Ooh. It is late. God damn it. Okay. I think he's learned. I think he's learned. He has not fucking learned. Aid man, come on. We try and do good. But you keep being a bitch. Oh shit, Q. Come on. There you go. Don't. I'm not gonna hit him. <laughs> I thought he was just gonna. I thought I could dodge that and do something else. Never mind. He he just fucking kills me right then and there, dog. Damn. <laughs> Come on. Okay. We need to fuck this guy up then. Come on, bitch, give me it. I'm sorry. I don't want to do it. Oh. Done. You should probably get out of here. Look, I'm not leaving until I get what's mine. You're not getting shit, bitch. I'll fucking put you on the ground. 
You hear me? Hey, if you can't be nice, I'm gonna make you wait outside. Yo. Oh, fucking shit. You bug my god, you bad person. And still you talk. Fuck you. Ah. Shit. What happened? What the hell is going on? What happened? A little misunderstanding that turned into a real shit show. Don't worry. We saw the best bits. There's more where that came from, girly. Knock mm -hmm. it off. Yeah, the fuck. Knock Look, it off. This is just the start of a shitty night for me. I just need the money he owes me, then I can go. What are you doing here? Oh, he, she just These fucking lips said are sealed. it. <laughs> yeah, no, don't ask her that you're here. You should know shit she's hurt. Why, Why was he, he hitting you? Maybe you should ask him that. Uh, well, but I ask you first. Stop being a bitch and let he me know. He asked me if I recognized him, knew who he was. I said I didn't. He started beating on me. Then you showed up, started beating on him. That about cover it, hon? I'm the woodsman, you whore. I saved Little Red Riding Hood from this monster. I cut this fucker open and filled his belly full of... Stones and threw him in the fucking river. That's who the fuck I am, you stupid bitch. Hey, what did I say about that word? Yo. Oh. Hey, them two motherfuckers just jumped out the fucking window. <laughs> Damn. Okay. Good, Big B. Oh, he ain't good. Fucking got hit on the car. Oh, hey, Toad. <clears throat> hey, Toad. My car. Oh. Yeah. <clears throat> Give me a second. That's your car? Oh, no, by all means. Take your time. Make yourself <laughs> comfortable. How's your Can insurance? You anything? Pillow, perhaps? So, uh, how good is your insurance? Called you, and you come to help. I can't be mad. But even when you help, things end up more fucked than they started. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, he gave me no fucking choice. Still fucking alive? How is this motherfucker not dead? I beat his ass up. His head fell on a fucking curb, and he didn't die. This dude, crazy motherfucker. Yep, choke him. Choke him. Come on. Fuck oh shit. I know you're fucking in there. Come on out, you fucking dog. I'll oh shit. Come on, wake up. Misery. Wake up. You fucking mongrel. Oh my god, my fucking man. Come on, big big B, come on. Oh shit. Dude, something was about to come out of me. How is he still fucking alive? Thanks, I guess. Thanks. Don't mention it. I'm just getting what he owes me. You all right back there? I mean, your eyes and the teeth. You're not really supposed to do that, are you? Not if I can avoid it. He might be a cat. Great. The guy's got an axe in his brain. He's not feeling that. Yeah. No. <laughs> it's more for me. He'll be. I'll kill you. How the you fuck? Let me I feel. <laughs> oh, okay. He's had enough. He's a fable. Son of a bitch can take plenty. No, okay. Come on. He had enough, alright? He had enough, alright? Yeah, get that axe out. Ah, 
I don't know how he didn't die from that shit, though. Damn. Okay, wait. I want to see if there's any way to unbind. Um. Face. So I don't need a fucking. I can't change controls. Alright, well, that's good to know. <clears throat> Let's continue. That doesn't work. Fucking smoker. Uh, I got a matchbook. Here. Thanks. I'm against smoking, but I'll let you smoke just for shit. Fuck it. Okay. What? Who do you work for, really? Oh. Hmm. These lips are sealed. My God. Lips are fucking Hey, you like my ribbon? I like it. Okay, we're gonna go on with it. I like it. Beautiful. Yeah, it's, it looks good. It looks good on her, dog. Thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. before we probably have we all sort of knew each other at one point or another but things change I guess I guess yeah I guess uh, 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 he's gone How okay Shit. stop we don't have to make any more of a thing out of it than it already is. She's right. I, I don't. I'm fine, really. Don't worry about me. Okay. How much was he owed you? A hundred. Damn. Damn bad for you to show up empty-handed. I'll be fine. <gasps> I do got some cash. I'll give her some. Let's because see, I'm kind of... Uh, 20. 58. That's all I got, but... It'll help, right? Take it. It's okay. I'll be fine. You've done enough, really. No, Just take it. Take the money, okay? You got me out of a bad situation back there. Thanks. Of course. I'm still gonna need a statement. I have to go drop off what I have. Meet me back at my office then. It's a little late for an office visit, Sheriff. I'll swing by your apartment. How do you know where I You am? live in the smallest apartment in the woodlands. Everyone knows that. Good to know. I don't think I will. You look like shit. I don't think I will. I don't will. use that term lightly. Some of these are pretty bad. Uh, okay, I couldn't. That's gonna leave a mark. Or maybe not. I don't think Big B likes to be touched. God, awkward as shit. Don't say hey. shit. What? I need to tell you something. What is it? You're not as bad as everyone says you are. Aw, thank you. I'll thank see you around, wolf. Ah, so that's what was gonna come out of me. A fucking wolf. On like, whoa. Yeah. Alright. Nice of her, dude. She's nice. Yeah. Sorry to talk about your car. Um, good luck on your insurance. Oh. Here we go. Is this the fucking intro? That's a fire intro though. Like, god damn.
Okay. So we saved the lady. What's her fucking name? I have no clue what her fucking name is. Who the fuck? Yeah, I got no fucking clue who her name is. <laughs> Damn. Alright. Oops. Episode 1. <laughs> now, as Big B starts to head to a hotel, he's wondering, like, huh. I wonder if I'll find that crazy Axeman motherfucker that I beat up. And right now, we're in favor of ten and it's a, it's a late night. So, he needs to enter his apartment to get fucking something, I think. Or sleep, you know, usual. I agree, Big B. Wait, is there anything over here? Uh, no. Okay. Enter. Fables created by Bill Willingham. God, I don't know why space has to be paused though. They don't. Ugh, self grass. You can sometimes be a disciplinarian. Can I stand on the grass though? No? Okay. I guess not. So, who the fuck? Stay off the grass. No walking on the grass. No white's orders. He made a sign and everything. Yeah, the fuck. Sure to send her an apology. Beauty. Hello, Big B. Big B. The fuck? Why are you on the I grass? It says stay off the grass. Anyone. You're out pretty late. Wait. A little odd. Yeah, but why'd you hide? Explanation. I swear. Why'd you hide? Huh? Hmm? I didn't know who it was. You can't be too careful these days. Do we live like in the most yeah. shittiest fucking neighborhood now? Like the most shittiest part? I'm late. Please, Big B. Promise me you won't tell Beast you saw me. Beast? He worries too much as it is, and it would just make my life a lot easier. Just please promise me. Sure. Okay, I promise. promise. Yes, I promise. I won't tell Beast fucking anything. Thank you, Big B. I'll explain it all to you later. I will, but I have to go. Okay. It depends. Thank you for trusting me. Really, I I appreciate it, Big B. Of course. Here's the thing, I'm too kind hearted. And I know it depends on what. If the beast. It depends on what the beast says. Because here's the thing, I don't know the beast. You could say something like, she stole everything. That could change it. But I also might be like, what if it's for a good thing though? Like, you know? This dude's fucking asleep. Yo, dog, wake up. Hey, you wink. Come on, Grimble. Hmm. Probably for the best. Nah, Grimble. Fucking passed out. On the fucking job. Just chilling, vibing. Doesn't want to work. Want to catch me? Shit. Dust this guy. I wear it. Damn, that shit dusty. He's still. Damn, he a hard fucking sleeper though. What if I knock it more? Okay, nothing fucking happens. Uh, mailbox. Do I get any mail? It's been a while since I got any mail. Let's see if you got mail, dog. Damn. Day in a row. Damn. No mail in seven days. 
That fucking blows. Oh, there's beast. Over here? Of interest? No? Okay. Let's go up. Oh. What's my name? Damn thing fell off again. Can I fell off again. Then fucking pick it up. Oh, there we go. How much longer is this gonna go on? Probably maybe for a while. Alright, let's just go up. Dun, 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 dun. Hmm. Damn. Big 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 guy with some hairy ass arms. Damn. Bigby, hey, wait up. Fuck. Have you seen my wife? Have you seen Beauty? I haven't seen her. Nope, haven't seen her. Oh, okay. Sorry to bother you. Damn it. Something's going on. I ain't saying shit. I ain't saying jack shit. Better pay me if, I, if you want me to say shit. But I'm not gonna say shit. If she told me not to say shit, I ain't gonna say shit. Big B's apart. Save the town. Damn. Damn. Just crack the window. Damn, so Big B's like living in a shitty apartment. That fucking blows. Water work? Oh, water does work. Fortunately enough. Yeah, you beat up Woodman, Axeman, or some shit. You got in a fight. Why do I even own you? Got thrown out a window. Everything. You should refill that. Damn it! Fucking refill that then. Do you want ice? Just like go to the sink and fucking refill it. Not that bad. Just like. Blueberry's file. Little beard. Who the fuck's blue beard? Trust this guy. Okay. Since he said bluebeards never trust it, I'm guessing you shouldn't trust them. That's Bluebeard? Oh god, he looks like a bad guy. He don't look good. Chinese food. I don't even remember ordering. Probably a bad sign. Yeah, I think someone may have broken to your house, Big B. Big B. What the fuck? Excuse the family. It's kind of getting hot in here. I should say something. Let's go. Hmm? Should help. Yeah. Now, who the fuck is this? Colon. Hi, Colon. Look at your first step. Wake up, Colin. Oh, hey, Big B. I'm in your chair, huh? Yeah. 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 Get out. This is a weird fucking place. Yeah, I should have noticed that when that dude didn't die by that axe. I should have probably expected some other more weird shit. Got a smoke? Yeah. Here you go, Colin. Thanks. Couple thousand more of these, we'll be even on that house you owe me. This has gotta stop. You can't keep sneaking off the farm like this. 
The fresh air and sunshine pitch they sell you on is bullshit. I didn't escape out of the homelands to end up in some prison, okay? Don't send me back there, Bigby. You don't know what it's like, okay? You haven't been there. Hey, Come I won't. Down. I'm not sending you back. That for me? Nope. The house didn't blow itself down, Bigby. That's all I'm saying. Do with that what you will. Now, I'm not saying it's reason enough for me to have definitely been offered a drink, but, uh... It would have helped ease some of the pain you once caused me, yes. It also would have shown everyone how different you are now. What I do? That was all you were saying. I'd be able to get some rest. I take it all back. This is why everyone hates you. Yeah. So, everyone hates me. Nah, I'm just giving you shit. I'm doing my best here. Clearly that nah. is not true. What oh. with the selfishness with the bourbon. But, uh, no. Um, hate's the wrong word. They fear you more than anything. You ate a lot of people back in your day. I thought we were all supposed to have a fresh start here. I you ate people? The past. Well, you can't change people's memories either. True. Look, I'm Ain't not wrong about that scared. shit. But it's real. People are scared of you. I mean, look at your hands. Okay. Let me explain. I beat up a guy, and he was being a bitch. And plus, I defended someone. Who'd that gives me a solid with? reason. A fable, right? I'm sure you're not going around punching Mondays. Oh no, it's not my fault. It wasn't my fault. I get the impression you say that a lot. Oh, fuck you. Piece of shit. You're a fucking pig, all right? You think my job is easy? You try keeping a bunch of fables from killing each other. How do you think this all works? I don't know. How? By being big and being bad. By being big and being bad. Don't say that shit in front of people. It's embarrassing. <laughs> That's yeah. the attitude that gets you in trouble. I'm sure you were shitty to everyone you came across tonight. No. Not everyone. I was Name nice. One. Honestly, I was shitty to Toad. I really was. Toad. Mr. Toad. Okay. How were his kids doing? He was yelling at him. Eh, sounds about right. Life is easier with friends, Bigby. And we live a long fucking time. I know you like this whole lone wolf thing you got going for yourself, but I've seen the way you look at snow, okay? You're not fooling me. Will you shut up? Well, maybe if my throat wasn't so parched, I wouldn't have to keep talking. Wait, that doesn't Just make sense. Just give me a drink, please. Colin, enough already. I haven't slept in two days. I went out a second story window, and I want to get in two seconds of shut eye before I... Look, if I give you this, let me sleep. Yeah, yeah, all right. Probably. Okay, here. Just let me sleep, all right? Not in two days. God damn. Thanks. That's rough. <laughs> God, that's so weird, though. Fucking talking animals, pigs, frogs. What else is gonna be a fucking fucking fish? Fucking matter. Did I not get any sleep at all? Okay, I'm fucking coming. Hold your tits. Damn. Who the fuck's at the door? Big B. Snow? Come with me. Oh, hey, Snow. What? Fuck's the problem, Snow? Snow. Snow. What? What's the Sorry, fucking problem? What is it? What happened? I just can't get into it this second. We need to hurry to... Hi. 
Hello. Good morning. Or evening. <laughs> yeah. Damn, I slept for a long time, haven't I? These walls are paper thin. We need to be careful. We'll talk outside. Got it. What? What the fuck's so up, though? What the fuck? Oh shit, god damn it. Sorry guys, my fault. Fuck's under it. Oh shit. What the fuck? You knew this girl? Is she was kind. She's not a Mundy, right? Who was she? I thought I knew everyone in Crazy Town. She looks familiar. I'm not saying prostitute. A working she's girl. A meister, though. A working girl. A working girl? I don't. I mean, I'm a working. Oh. She looked like she was working, though. Something. Because she might have worked for someone. You didn't threaten to kill us both. No. You don't think he... I don't think anything yet. Just give me a second. It's just... Terrible. Uh... It took me a second did to you realize see anyone? what I was even looking at. So, did you see anyone else? No. No one. No cabs, no Fuck. voices, Mondays? Maybe, but... Maybe? No. I don't think so. I would remember. Okay. Okay. Take me. Did one of us do this? There hasn't been a murder in Fable Town in a long time. All the more reason we shouldn't start a panic before we know what's going on. That's have a look around. We don't have much time before people will be coming through here. Got it. All right, evidence. She got a no, Doug. She got a ribbon in her mouth. Look. Ribbon in her mouth. What is it? It's a ribbon. Yeah. There's some kind of symbol here. Hmm. The fuck? I, I don't recognize it. Neither do I. Is that a St. Rose skin? Uh... Did this to her. What could do something like that? I don't think it could be an axe because it's sharp or something with magic attached to it. She was placed here with some care. What do you mean? We can see that someone didn't just toss her here. She was deliberately placed for us to find. What kind of monster would do this? A monster. That's who would do this. Damn. Nope. Rax. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Damn, man. She I'm was sorry. nice, too. This is just so surreal. <sighs> um, what... What do you want to do next? We need to investigate more. We still have some time. I should keep investigating the area. Okay. Good idea. Yeah, it is a good idea. We gotta check out this blood, though. Look at it. Is it blood fresh, though? Blood. Drops of blood. I'd say it's been here an hour, maybe. Okay, so it's relatively fresh. 
What the fuck is this? Scrap it. Scrap it fabric. Fabric. Looks like jeans. Doesn't tell me much. It tells us that the person was wearing fucking pants. There's blood up here. So it's in the trash though. Anything in it? Just some loose trash. Yeah. But there is blood. Yep, more blood. Someone might have hopped a fence, got caught, then left the trail I found earlier. Or it could have been her body getting stabbed that. Blood. Still wet. Sharp enough. Okay, so someone that was either her body being dragged and then cut no, there would be more blood. So I would say. Let's look for more shit and then we'll go talk to her. Anything on the motherfucking grass? No, nothing. What are you doing? Better to be thorough. Sure, just hurry up. We don't have much time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We should move her before anyone shows up. We'll find out more at the business office. She'll be in the books. I'm sure of it. Vicky, She'll be in do the you books. Have any idea what's going on? Someone brought it here, but this also makes it a message. Because they just left the head there. Nobody. Nothing. It's just so I don't wanna say any of those though. Just not ready to say yet. Fine. Let's just get upstairs. I'm unsure, Snow, okay? I don't know if it's a fucking message. Are you gonna have to talk or some to shit. about this? As long as King Cole is gone, he's acting mayor. He needs to know. And he's going to find out anyway. So we may as well get out in front of it. It'll just be worse if he finds out we held it from him. I know you don't like him, but he's our boss. This is part of the job. We should wait until we have more to tell him. Right now, all we know is a girl is dead. Telling Crane doesn't change that. And I've got all the motivation I need to find out who did this. That sounds reasonable, but I don't know. No, we literally have nothing. Just, I just person don't want him died. Here. Unknown. Nothing else. We you just fucking die. Got your head shot off. Everything. We need to figure out who this girl was so we can find whoever did this. Take this back to Dr. Swinehart. He can take a look at it. I'll meet you at the business office. Damn. That fucking blows. R.I.P. that girl. Yo, what's up, guys? What are you blind? What? Oh god! You don't see there's a line? I've been standing here a half hour already. You get to just walk in. Must be nice being the sheriff. Do whatever the fuck you like. I, I work, work here. And what great work you do, sheriff! Oh, hmm. that didn't feel very genuine. I wasn't kind. All right. Fucker. Hmm. You can suck this dick. Because you are the one bringing this to me, Miss Snow. The one who so simply stumbled upon this catastrophe on our very doorstep. Shit. The last thing I need with Mayor Cole away is a hysteria. Do you understand me? Yes. Did you tell him? Of course I Don't do. interrupt me, Miss Snow. You asked me a question. Don't change the subject. Shut you the fuck up. Miss Snow. Stop your fucking bickering. You news as soon as I could. You are trusted to keep things running smoothly around here. This no is one is disaster. to fucking blame. Who else is to blame if not you? It isn't anyone's fault. Instead of trying to assign blame, maybe we should figure out how to catch the fucker who did this. Yeah. Oh, is that how you see things? Yes. Sheriff, you are the one charged with protecting the citizens of Fable Town. Your failure to do so cost someone their life. Oh. And the safety of the entire community. Buddy. I haven't slept in two days. I got my ass beat. I jumped out a fucking window, laying on Toad's car. Stop! I fucking got choked. What? What? 
What do you think I'm trying to fucking do? I'm trying my best here. I my I slept. Jesus. Tell me fuck. you've been doing something. Are there any leads? Suspects? Anything. Anything at all. Any shred of evidence you two know what the hell you're doing. Because right now I have half a mind to fire the boat. Pimp. Because yeah. remember, she had to pay someone hmm. by the looks of it. Was she uh yeah. She was worried about a money situation. Yo. Yeah. This is just wonderful. Not only is a fable killed, but it was a fable hooker to boot. You two need to get a handle on this situation quickly and quietly. The last thing we need is all of Fable Town knowing there's a killer amongst us. Snow. Yes, sir? Call Vivian right this minute and let her know I'm coming in early for my massage. I will. Where is the bottle of wine you were to purchase? Wine? Oh, bother. Forget it. Shut the fuck up, all right? We're trying our best. You ain't Do doing shit. Job, Sheriff. Well, we'll find someone who can. Fuck you. You know what? Stop. We'll get on it right away, sir. Oh, you lucky she held me back. I, mm, I would have passed up a storm. All right. Okay, true. I would have well, pissed gone better. off. Well, I guess I should have listened to you and waited. I wasn't what? gonna say I told you so. You don't mm. have to say it. Yeah, you should have waited. Been better to have her offer. Get our ducks in a row. Oh, Crane doesn't like people smoking in it. Uh. Never mind. Smoke away. Get some morning massage. Who gets a massage this early? Crane. Yeah, early in the morning. It doesn't really matter the time of day. The mere scent of stress, and he's out the door. What the fuck is that? Is, is he gone? Yes, thankfully. What the fuck? Oh, hey, birdie. Buffkin. Buffkin. Hello, Miss Snow. Drinking this early? Where did you get that? It was by Mr. Rickabod's desk. Then don't you think it probably belongs to him? Maybe. And it's alcohol. How are you today, Mr. Bigby? I'm doing fine. Don't say fuck off. I'm doing fine. Fine, Buffkin. Thanks for asking. Buffkin. Hey! The books. Which books? The ones with all the fables in it. I'm not sure I was any more specific. <laughs> Bring the first three. Be back in a few minutes. All right. Damn, this is a big ass library in a small weapon. fucking room. There's bound to be information on her here. Somewhere. We'll at least be able to get her real name from the books whenever Buff can find them. In the meantime, poke around. Maybe the mirror can help. How the fuck can a mirror help? I really have to get this appointment. You know what? I, I don't even want to ask. Let me know if you need anything. Okay, how the fuck can a mirror help? But Hi. here's the thing I don't want to ask because th there's a talking button. Hi. What, what am I gonna expect? What, is the mirror gonna fucking talk shit? What, is this gonna be like fucking Aladdin or some shit? Here, let me rub the lamp. Try. <laughs> he actually fucking rubbed the fucking lamp. What the fuck? No, we got your invoice. He just yes. literally rubbed the lamp. Okay, that wasn't... It should be squared away. Magic cards? Strength. In all forms. Yeah. Yes, I mean. Tower. What does that mean? I have no well, that's idea what, not that what I have is. here. What's this one? Damn. Ten of swords. What the fuck is this supposed to mean? I have no fucking clue. A dude getting stabbed. Why are you keeping that? I'll be sure to let him know. Back here. No. Alright, let's go talk to a fucking mirror. Hey, magic mirror. I got a question. You know the rules. I don't what have the time fuck? for this shit. Your impatience is callow. 
You're needlessly cruel, but have some respect for our history rules. <sighs> mirror, mirror. If you're able, tell me all about uh. this fable. <laughs> See? Was that so hard? Yeah, I'm about two seconds away from kicking a hole in you. There's no need for that. Fine. Of which fable do you wish to know? We need to know more about the girl. Uh, fuck! I don't even know her name. God damn it. Um. Do I only have one chance? Buffkin? Woodsman. Show me the woodsman. Where is he? What you see is complete. The woodsman stumbles down a street. No shit. Which street? Mm. I'm sorry, Bigby. I can only show you what can be seen. I don't know her name. I don't know her name. Not yet, anyway. Well, until you do, I can't help you. Yup. Yeah. Buffkin. Show me Buffkin. Yeah, what's Buffkin doing? Hey, put down the bottle and get to work. <laughs> Still looking. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Look at snow. Show me Snow White. Not much of a request. She's in this very room. Oh. Buffkin Show doing. Buffkin. Buffkin doing his job. Hey, oh, this motherfucker ain't. Put down the bottle and get to work. <laughs> Still looking. This motherfucker ain't doing shit. Nobody. Very well. Please return should you wish to ask about someone else. Or someone new. Alrighty. So that didn't do shit. Buffkin and his dirty alcoholic ass. Well, I'm just sure we'll get it all cleared up. Okay. Thank you. Got the books? Yeah, he got the books. Good buffkin, you ain't drunk. You probably drunk as shit right now. <sighs> shit. Alright, let's head back. So we got a tree terriot card. Ugh, excuse me. Can I walk? Thank you. So let's read books, ladies and gentlemen. What's on this book? Hmm. Oh the fuck. What the fuck is this? What? I can't read any of this shit. Yeah, I, I can't. can help. Yeah, thanks. Thank you. We look out Buffkin. for each other. Oh, never do it. Yeah. Buffkin. Translate. Hmm. An exquisite design from the good China of To To. Mr. To. He probably wrote this in himself. There's the axe, man. Just about this one. Here. Yes, from the axe of the woodsman, a druid blessing, actually. Someone bless that thing. I only translate. What about this fucking horse? What's it say about that? It says brickle bit in an older elvish hand. What's brickle bit? A magic word. A map do. Makes animal shit gold. <laughs> you're, you're joking. No, no, he's fucking serious. <laughs> Make the animals fucking shit out gold. What the fuck? What's that? It reads, Mark of the House of the Frog Prince. Mm, that's quite who I'm looking for. Frog Prince. Oh. Oh, that's it. This is the one. Where is this symbol from? Which family or story? That's an odd one. Family name? I'll go look it up. On the internet? It means every kind of fur in German. Donkey skin. Yes. What does it say? <sighs> donkey skin girl, also known as donkey skin, <laughs> also known as <laughs> ass skin, <laughs> uh, prefers to go by the name Faith. Poetic? But what the fuck? 
named your fucking child a donkey. <laughs> That's the most shittiest fucking name ever. Just imagine, like, the doctor, like, bringing out the baby, like, oh, okay, keep on pushing, keep on pushing. Oh. Baby comes out, right? Uh, here's your baby. What would you like to name him? I would like to name my child Donkey. <laughs> fucking doctor's like, what? So you're basically calling your child a fucking ass? God, dude, what the fuck? <sighs> the story That's so of fucking donkey skin. There was once a donkey great skin. With a beautiful queen. Just imagine naming your fucking child Donkey Skin. The okay. queen grew ill and had her husband promise to only marry the most beautiful girl in the kingdom. After a long search, it became clear that the only woman in the land that could match her beauty was... Uh, what? His daughter, Faith. So that's her name, Faith. She had a magic cloak made from the skin of her father's prized donkey that would hide her beauty so she could escape his kingdom. Eventually, she married a prince who could see past the magic cloak and knew her true beauty. And they lived happily ever after. Should I mark it, Miss Snow? Yes. Please. Damn. Deceased. Donkey skin also known as Tucky skin also known as ass skin prefers to go wet. <laughs> that fucking blows to be named fucking Donkey skin. And what's her husband's name? Lawrence. Prince Lawrence. Jesus fuck. So we got two we new got names, Prince for. Lawrence and Faith. Her name's Faith. She was married to Prince Lawrence. I mean, that's more than Her we name was Faith. Yeah. Alright, so Faith. To the no, let's ask Amir first. You think he did it? Yeah, he's our first suspect though. Well, I know what it's like to have a falling out with a prince. I don't trust any of them at this point. Press the button, but I guess that shit didn't work. Fuck me, I guess. Alright. Let's give one look at this book. Any information on fables in our community will be somewhere in these books. We already know her name, but feel free to have a look if you like. That's Colin. Oh, that motherfucker. Let's start from left. Hmm. Me. Yo. And him. The woodsman. Yo. A disaster. Who's this? I'm pretty sure that's supposed to be me. What the fuck? Yeah. Wars. So is it like Not a? This better. shit's weird, though. I like how it's raised, hmm. though. I think her name was Red. She moved in with the Arab. Red Riding Hood. Apparently, he saved him. Or he saved her. And her mare, Beast. That's what I was thinking. Huh. Colin and his brothers. Colin, my man. And this is it. Yep. That's her, all right. Long time ago. What the fuck? Ichabod Crane. Scared shitless. What's hmm. that? Her boss. At his finest moment. He's scared as fuck. How he ended up running this place. Probably because he's an old man with a bald spot. Well, with balding shit. It's time that changed. Ah. I haven't seen this. Badger around for a while. Badger. He likes his privacy, I think. I wish Toad would like his a bit more. Mm. Nice man. Toad. Alright. Let's go ask Amir some shit. Mirror, mirror on the fucking ground. What's the biggest dumbass of them all? And plus, tell me what this charge card you know means. This means. Tarot is a backwards art. I wouldn't put too much stock in its wisdom, Bigby. Not when you've been so helpful. Previsions muddy. I'm as clear as a window. Well, I fucking go clear in that fucking mirror of yours. Blah blah able. Blah 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 about this fable. Of which fable do you wish to know? Okay. Nobody right God, now. I did not mean a Very fucking well. right click. Please man. return should you wish to ask about someone, someone else. Or, or someone, someone new. Okay. 
Mirror, mirror on the wall. Mirror, mirror, blah, blah, able, blah, blah, blah about this fable. Of which fable do you wish to know? I wish to know about... Faith. Show me... Show me faith. Through powerful magic, her whereabouts concealed. Unfortunately for you, these lips are sealed. God damn it. These lips are sealed. It's not my choice of phrasing, Vivian. It's simply the way this has to be. So fucking dumb. Prince Lawrence. Her husband? She's a prince, I think. Show me Prince Lawrence. Oh, What's he shit. been doing? Where is this? Where's what? Do you know where Prince Lawrence lives? If he's a prince, probably relocated in the South Bronx. Yellow building, red window shutters. Red frames. Yep, that's the one. I can take us there. Not yet. One more person. Faith's father. Show me Faith's father. The old king. Yep. He's fucking dead. I guess that crosses him off the suspect list. So Prince Lawrence is a Doesn't suspect. Know about you right now. But there's Anything blood on the floor yeah. with a knife. I'll have to do for now. Come on. We're going over there. Gotcha. Who the fuck's Sorry. calling? Sorry. We have to get back. Okay then. Hello, Woodland's business office. Yes. I he is. <laughs> Hold on. Big B. It's for you. Oh, really? Mama. Oh, shit. Sure. Oh, hey, Toad. What do you want? What? Big B. Shit. Listen, right? There's a bloke upstairs going through all the woodsman things. Get over here, Big B, before he... Oh, wait. Hang on. Boy, shit. Hey! Shit. What was that about? We need to go. to say. Something going on over at Toad's place. What about Faith's husband? I don't know. I couldn't really tell. But he could be in trouble. Maybe we should go there anyway to search her apartment. Toad might have to wait. Whenever you're ready. But Toad. Some shit's happening at Toad's place, though. Did Toad say who was there? Was it the woodsman? I don't know. It's possible. Whoever it was, it didn't seem like Toad was happy to see him. Well, maybe Prince Lawrence can wait. Yeah, you didn't see him. He could use some help, too. Well, where to first? Well, here's the thing. Prince Lawrence... He had a knife on the floor. Which was bloody shit, did I look? Okay. Which was bloody. Which could mean he could have already been dead right now. But Toad, it could be a suspect too. We don't know. Because he's going through the woodsman things. So Big B, shit. Listen, right? There's a bloke upstairs going through all the woodsman things. You think he did it? What's her husband's name? Lawrence. Prince Lawrence. I say Toad's apartment. Toad's apartment. Toad sounds like he needs help right now. We can check in on Prince Lawrence. Okay. I'm not looking forward to breaking the news to him anyway. Am I gonna have to be a mo another dude's fucking ass, eh? The Woodsman's apartment, in South Bronx, morning, early morning. You guys made a real mess. Yeah. Oh yeah, we did. Worse than the day. I went to that. Somebody up there? Hey! Wait here. Shit. Go. Shit. Fucking cock, dude. How did they lose him? How did the fuck did he get out already? I'm sorry. That's 
enough, all right? Just shut it. I don't even remember half of this shit. Is Todd an abusive father? Son? Dog, I think. Be nice on there, okay? Depends. <laughs> Big B and Miss White. Surely you didn't come all this way just for my bother. Sorry, Bigby. It's embarrassing to have to admit, but uh, I thought there was someone else in Woody's place. There wasn't, though. No, uh, not when I checked. <laughs> Nothing but a leaky drain pipe. Imagination must have got the best of me. So, you know, false alarm. Sorry for dragging Miss White into this, but thanks for coming. Much appreciated. What's going on? Well, what do you mean? Nothing's going on, Bigby. I don't know what you mean. Truly. False alarm is all. Uh-huh. Uh Are you alright? He's fine, Miss White. Just stung his little toe. Better swimmer than Walker, just like his dad. Wanna... So, I guess you'll be taking off now. No need to hang around this here anymore. This motherfucker had something. I mean, I'm sorry you came all the way here for nothing. But it was nothing, really. Someone was here, and something's going on. Just so this trip wasn't a complete waste of time, I'm gonna look around a bit before we leave, okay? Are you fine with that? The longer talk, the longer this takes, so just stand over there and shut up. All right, all right. I just don't want to waste your time, is all. Uh, have a seat. Have a cup of tea. Whatever you like. Whew. Grown-ups. Am I right? Uh. Hey, you know what? Flycatcher said you had a. Pr what the fuck? Pretty awesome insect collection. I'd really love to see it. Is it in your room? It has a weevil. Cool. Ah, a weevil. What the fuck is a weevil? <laughs> What the fuck is even a weevil? A weevil. Is that even a real thing? Oh. It's a Pokemon. He has a Pokemon in his room, guys. <laughs> what the fuck? <coughs> Just mind the upholstery while you're looking for nothing. Shut the fuck up, Todd, alright? You acting all Wait, I saw something. Yeah. The lock's busted. Huh? The lock. It looks like somebody kicked in the door. Oh, for Christ's sake, the fucking lock's been busted for weeks, mate. Rotted just like everything else in this bloody building. Hmm. Okay. Todd's hiding something. It. <laughs> Todd, you're not a good liar. And the lamps broke too. Yeah. Fucking hell. Damn thing must have fell off the table. Uh huh. The lamp just fell off the table. You know, with this place, it's like living on a foundation of termites. It is. All so cheap, it's a wonder it stays standing as long as it does. Something's happening. Two plugins. Todd's fucking hiding something. Okay, Todd, you better spit the fucking beans out right now because I there's fucking blood. 
I'm a good sniffer. I'm a fucking weed. Why is that blood still fresh? Oh, well, I cut me end. <laughs> Ran around like a tit trying to pick out a rap. Must have got some on the furniture. Lamp in pieces, blood on the wall. It's awful, I know. Sounds painful. Oi, don't you go mothering now. The wound didn't sit very long, you know. Could have been a fable, I suppose. <laughs> and a frog. Where's your wound? What the fuck is this? That is where the that lamp. More blood? No. Just a clean space in the dust. Did you move something? Ah. Oh. Maybe one of Junior's toys or something. I mean, the lamp. Know. It's the lamp. This motherfucker moved the lamp. If you're gonna say something, out with it. That broken lamp used to be here, right? Just tell me what happened. Nothing happened, mate. Nothing. And why did the lamp have to be there? Of all the blooming pointless inquiries. It's my own play. Don't you think I'll know what happens in it? Power because outlet. It wasn't on that table, Toad. There isn't any room in the electric outlet. Huh? What are it you... It was plugged in over here, and now it's there. Uh, I did some refiguring. Who fucking cares? And not plug it in? Come on, Toad. I just hadn't oh. gotten around to it yet. You see how many damn plugs there are? There's not that many, dog. A bloody fucking pitchfork. Could do a better job dusting, or no? So what happened? What happened? There's fresh blood on the tip. You could smell it from the door. Oh, I was I was poking the coals and it slipped a bit. Sliced up in my foot like a seashell. Looked like a shit ugly thing. Your foot looks fine, okay, Todd. Sheriff, now what? Oh, I thought you cut your hand. You dropped it on your foot? You told me before that you cut your hand. Yeah, no, I, I did cut my hand. I cut my hand first, and that made me drop the damn thing on my foot. <laughs> uh, ruinous flip of events, really. Okay. Oh my god, would you not make a big faff out of this? That, that's what he is asking me like. Pierce, Sheriff. I'm telling you everything that happened. Why don't you believe me? I mean, things happen, you know. No crime in a little accident. I this think someone was attacked. A mess, Toad. Looks like after a struggle or a fight. I don't know why you'd be covering for it, but I know you're lying about something. But I'm not. And you're just gonna make it worse for yourself the longer you keep up the act. I'm not bullshitting you. You are bullshitting. We'll see. Let me go check in on the fucking child and shit. If I got more shit to say than you. Though most people think they are. Uh huh. How's it going? Toad's hiding something, but. I don't know what yet. Did the kid say anything? No, nothing really. He was really upset though earlier. He won't say why. Hmm. Something's going on. Did Toad abuse a child? Okay, Toad. I'm gonna talk to you once. Never been good with the feminine duties. Homebody stuff with my clumsy hands. Come clean. You want me out of here? I want out of here. Just come clean. What's going on? Place needs a little brooming, that's all. Stop fucking hiding. Okay. Is there anything else down here, man? Yeah, it's, there's a fucking window. Thing outside. Oh. There's scratches. Is it now? If it's blood, you know what happened. I no, there's marks here on the windowsill. And what's that about? 
no real reason. It's the size of your Just fucking last fingers. Night when I'd come out, I was in a, a downright tizzy, mate, as you would be. <laughs> and I plum forgot the keys to this place. And I had to climb in through the bloody window. Uh-huh. Really? Scared Junior off to death. Wait, so maybe someone came through the window, grabbed the pitchfork, hit someone, knocked over the lamp on accident, broke it, and kicked the do door down. You, uh, take the latch. Album yet? I think I got it. I think I got it. Why didn't Junior let you in? Junior was home. Why didn't he let you in? It was the middle of a sodding night, the thief. I'm supposed to wake him because his jammy daddy didn't remember to check his pocket. Bigby, come on. I'm begging for mercy over here, old boy. I was looking forward to a nice afternoon. Just me and me son, and you've taken up enough of a day. He was fucking crying. sniffing around at me private belongings. I'm sorry I called. Really, I am. But will you please, please just... Bugger off! Not yet. Not yet? Yeah, not that yet. For anyone, Big B. There wasn't any scrap. So when? When are you gonna leave? I mean, I feel like I'm on trial here. In my own bloody home. It's not seemly. When? When you start telling me the truth, Toad. Well, I've told you the truth. Toad. Man. Jesus Christ, what more do you want? Toad. I'll I'm about me in. I broke the lamp. Be nice. I forgot my key, so I climbed the sill. Toad, these stories have made no sense. You didn't cut yourself on the poker. You didn't forget your keys. You want to tell me what's going on? She doesn't think much of me, I don't think. Oh, I wouldn't necessarily say that. Progress? Oh, shit. Mr. Toad, you're bleeding. Take off the hat. I fucking knew it. <sighs> it was that butcher, a, a twiggle, thumb or D. You gotta strip them down to their johnnies before you can tell which is which. Who come bulging in, screaming about something a woodsman had? Or thought he had, I don't know. He tore up the place, beat me up when I said I didn't have it. I tried to go out the window. But he pulled me back in. Oh, it's been a hard morning, I can tell you that. What was he looking for? I have no idea. I would have told you. I wanted to, really, I did. But he said if word of this ever got back to him, if he ever thought you knew, or Miss White, he'd come back and kill my boy. Oh, shit. I even tried to give a bastard a coat. He wouldn't take it. Whose coat? The girl. Dad borrows things from people who live here. Uh, mm. sometimes. <laughs> oh, so I don't steal nothing. Turn around here will astonish you, mate. You'll merely repossess what's been left behind. Well, we'll be taking the coat now. If she has next of kin, family, anyone. All right. Fetch him the fur. Fine bit of dress it is. Damn. No, I wouldn't wear it outside. Wait. There's a note. It's an envelope. Fucking hell, of course there is. But to my luck, it's a map to some bloody doubloons. It's addressed to Prince Lawrence. Do you want to try and give it to him, or...? Don't make it a dilemma. Honestly, I don't feel good about this because I saw Just the blood knife. It. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna fucking do. I'm sorry. Faint. What could she have been sorry for? I don't know. Maybe Lawrence does. Well, it's been quite a surprising day for all of us, hasn't it? I see you out, but I'm afraid of dripping any more blood in the place. 
Okay. It was very nice talking to you, TJ. Thanks. Aw. Uh, see ya. Dude, TJ, TJ sounds like a nice guy. Damn. They both just been attacked. That's why. That fucking blows. Damn. Does it always go that smoothly? Not often. So, the princes now? Lawrence's, yeah. It's our best lead. Our only lead, really. Yeah, true. You put it that way. Lawrence's apartment. South Bronx, early morning. I don't want to stay here any longer than we have to, so let's just pick an approach and stick to it, okay? Yep. I got you. Just humor me. Uh. When the magic mirror showed me this apartment, I think I saw a knife inside, covered in what looked like blood. I wasn't expecting that. Uh. Yeah. Well, like I said, let's not overcomplicate things. You can question him while I look around for it. Gotcha. If he objects. We are here on official Fable Town. Okay, that's good. She trusts me a bit. Be persuasive if necessary. Or you can. I will probably be more persuasive. Because I want to talk my way out of things. I don't want to cause force and shit. Oh, shit. That don't look good at all. Prince Lawrence. Can you hear me? Are you okay? Yeah, something's up. Oh, shit. Ah, dude. You got fucking body. Oh my god. He's still alive. Snow, go okay, get help. Dr. Swinehart. I'll stay with you. No. No. Let me go. How are you still fucking alive? <laughs> what is it that you're telling us? Water. Water. Kitchen. Let's go get water quickly. Water. Water. Go. 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 If you have something to ask him, you should do it now. Who did this? Who did this to you? Hey. Hey. Still have that letter. Yes. It's only two words. But he died without seeing one. I'm sorry. We need to figure out what happened here and find whoever did this. No, it, he literally said Faith did this. I asked who did this, and then he said, Faith. So it has, to, so Faith done that. But someone else killed Faith. Okay, let's start from the kitchen, though, because I saw a letter, and I want to read that. 
Pay the rent next week. Pizza in the fridge. Please don't look for me. Goodbye. Yeah, let's look at his body and see what he has on him. Uh, got a gun. Fingerprints? They'll be on the grip and the trigger. It looks like he fired one bullet too. Someone did. Is the caliber of the gun I'm looking for. I think he may have shot himself or some shit. That doesn't really help. Eh. Yeah, could change something. What are they? Pills. Description is sleeping pills. Oh. Sleeping pills, yeah. Uh, nothing else. Yeah, let's look at this fucking knife, though. It's sharp. There's blood on the blade. So he either got shot. On the yeah. So I don't know why it's over here. I just don't understand. Why would someone want to kill him? So he either got shot or stabbed. Maybe both. That looks dry as shit. Seems a little sticky. You know, I was gonna say let's look at that shit because it's kind of bumpy. You know, is that a bullet hole? Oh, yep, that's a fucking bullet hole. When do you think that was taken? Before all this. Yo. Fuck's in here. The bed. There's a lot of blood though. Oh, no. Better. What is that? Uh, what does it say? Dearest Faith, I've been never meant to hurt you, and I cannot endure knowing that I have. This was for the best. I'll see you again. Love your devoted Lawrence. Oh, fuck. Do they both have a falling out? Hopefully they're together now. Yeah, hopefully they are. Hopeful at this point. So, got that. Um, looks pretty good. Dusty. No one's read these in a while. Was it? Oh, fuck me! Stay here! No! Fuck me, dude. Hey! Stop! Leave me alone! Dude, that shit scared the living fuck out of me. Fuck. Fuck. Go, go, go. Could've jumped over it, that would've been easier. Uh, this one. Out the window. Gotcha. Jump. Oh. God damn it, Big B. Oh shit. Jump out the window. Oh! Hey! Get his ass. Ease up, Bigby. 
We're on the same side here. You. Then why the fuck bitch. did you run? Make me run after you. Why <coughs> did you run? <coughs> what? Why did you run? Fuck, man. Because you chased after me. The fuck was I supposed to do? A man's dead. I know how it looks, but I had nothing to do with that. You're covered in blood. You're covered in blood. Look, I was just asking him about the girl. That's all. When I mentioned her being dead, he freaked out. I figured someone had told him. How was I supposed to know? Shit. Fucker shot himself right in front of me. I couldn't stop him, man. Fuck. You're looking for the woodsman, right? I know where he is. My guy says he's holed up at the trip trap. We can go over there right now, the both of us. My employer's looking to ask him a few questions, too. Well, what was he even doing back there? What anyway. were you doing back there? Checking out the guy who was married to the girl. Seemed a good place to start. Tracking down leads. What kind of leads? Oh, I can't tell you that. It's confidential. Oh, oh confidential my ass. So I'm on the lead, too. Nope. Say that I do. Come on, you're coming with me. This could have been easy. <laughs> Don't worry. It still is. Come on. Dumb. Dumb? Yeah, it is. Look, it'd be much easier for you. No, to... I'm D. He's dumb. What the fuck? <gasps> They're fucking twins? Okay. He almost looked peaceful. Fucking bullshit, nope. twin ass. Except twin motherfuckers. Yeah. I get raped. Open wound on the back of your head. Okay. Yeah. <sighs> just, just, just fucking. Where the fuck did they go? Where'd they go? Well, after the one guy hit you and the other one finished kicking you. That explains the ribs. Then they jumped into a car and drove off. Come on, get up. Guess we're out of options. Yep. He mentioned the trip trap. Then that's where we'll go. I'll call a cab. Alrighty. We got a cab then. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. We're driving here. I'm walking from Every the car. Every time I think I'm getting a handle on what's going on, things just get more complicated. It feels like. We're always a step behind. The woodsman is the only lead we've got. And he was one of the last people to see Faith alive. Getting some answers out of him will start to clear things up. I hope you're right. Digsy? Be yeah. honest with me. Who do you think... did this? I'm not sure anymore. I know it's still early, but... <sighs> I just feel a step behind. I don't know. It's an uncomfortable feeling. Faith was in trouble. Afraid of someone. Yeah, the pimp. I need to find out who. Might be whoever she was working for. That's who I was thinking. Faith's There's still pimp. a lot of questions. We find the woodsman, figure out what he knows, and go from there. Yup. Makes sense. That's probably the best approach. No, because here's the thing. She was worried about not paying someone. But I only gave her 50. She needed 100. So that wasn't enough. So her pimp might have gotten pissed. Tucked her. <laughs> head off. Dropped her out there. Doorstep. Blonk. Boom. Everything happened. So yeah. It's probably her pimp. I'm not saying Bluebeard because we don't fucking know Bluebeard. Thanks for your help, actually. Thanks I for wish there was Oh, okay. You still are gonna Sorry. fall in love, I'm guessing. Uh, go ahead. Go ahead. I didn't mean to cut you off. No, it's... Just, just go. Just go. Just go. It's nothing. I just...
fucking say it. Seeing all this today, there are fables that are struggling worse than I'd imagined. We pay so much attention to the residents of the woodlands. You forget there's a whole community out there to save. Damn. To have to turn to prostitution. I I wish there was more we could do. Well, that's the world, Snow. Be, but Crane runs things his own way. You're doing oh, your yeah. best. It's all anyone can do. Obviously, you don't know what I do all day. Right now, I'm the gatekeeper, making sure none of these disenfranchised folks are, as he puts it, wasting his time. Can fix it. I don't know. It's just a broken system. The fables who walk in through the back door like Bluebeard, we have all the time in the world for them. You try and come in through the front door, through the proper channels, asking for anything, needing help. Well, I turn you away. Now things are worse off than they've ever been. Damn. Well, that's not true. So it's right. the system. System's work. fucked. Maybe this isn't for me. I thought public service was pure. A way to help. You'll figure it out. You're better than I am with this political stuff. Well, that's not saying much. I trust yeah. you to make the right decision. She's been fucking great. I hope you're Since right. I met her. Oh, I know I'm right. Alright. Trip trap. Bar. Woodsman, we ain't gonna cause any problem. We're gonna just go. We're just, we're just gonna, gonna talk to him. We're just gonna talk to him. Yeah. That looks like a fucking Maybe pimp. What is this motherfucker gonna pimp slap me? He looks like a fucking pimp. Bigby. Yeah. I. <laughs> just be careful. Oh, I will. I'm a fucking, I'm a fucking wolf. Don't worry. This will be over soon. I hope so. Yeah, this will, this will all be over soon. Okay. Trip, trap, bar. Let's see what's up. What we got here, big boy? We're time to do some investigator type shit. If we see the woodsman, we're just gonna talk calm. Not gonna pull any shit. Ain't planning to do that. And now they're all giving me. Oh, it's this what asshole. Do you want, <sighs> just in the neighborhood. I was in the neighborhood. Thought I'd pop in and say hello. Well, fucking hello. Now you can get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Can I Look, at least get a drink? I'm not even gonna ask where he is now, okay? I just want to know the last time he was here. That's all. Who? I'm being nice. So try again. He hasn't been here for a few weeks. They're no, lying. Maybe. I don't know. They're maybe fucking lying. He hasn't been here in a while, if he's been here at all, which... I don't know. Does he tell you when to close, too? Mm. Nope. Yep. And he doesn't tell me when to tell you to fuck off. Oh, really? Alright. Which man? Okay. So, this motherfucker, we're gonna talk to him for a sec. He a regular? I don't know who you're talking about. The one with the bald head and the beard. Never seen him. Oh, that's bullshit. Th stop your fucking lying. This motherfucking bitch lying. Who's is that? Someone who left. Woodsman? Someone like 
The guy I'm looking for? No, I'm telling you. I haven't seen him for a couple days. I swear she's fucking lying, dog. A lot of these walk out the door? Yeah, it's called advertising. That's a, wait, that's a matchbook, I think. Huh. We'll get a refund. Fuck you. Mm. The wood's getting out. Yeah, you make matches. What do you fucking do? You make fucking matches. I'm gonna talk to this dude last. Cigarette mm. machine. Damn. Damn. Yeah. Am I? What's what the fuck is that? Pickled pickled eggs. What? What is Let pickled me solve eggs? The for you. What? They're pickled eggs. Oh, I know what they are. Oh, thank you for telling me. I'm just trying to figure out why anyone would eat this. Pickled eggs. It sounds fucking disgusting. Pickled eggs. No, that doesn't Come sound. Come on. Have you seen the woodsman around? I don't know who that is. Big guy, beard, flannel, kind of a shit bag. Hard to miss. Uh, <laughs> sure you don't know. He's a shit bag too. Yeah. Would a drink help you remember? How about I buy you a drink? I'll let you keep your drink and piss off. Well, how about you suck the stick and fucking tell me where the woodsman is? Because I need a fucking lead. You ain't giving me shit. You're being an asswipe ever since I fucking met you. A lot of stools in this place. Um, I don't want to have... You got a problem? Got a yeah. problem, friend? You got a problem? I don't like you. And now you're sitting right next to me. You could ask me to move. You gonna order something? Or you just here to bother my customers? Hey. <laughs> you know what I mean. Give me a Midas gold. You want a wine? Sure. I think they have some at the bar down the street. <laughs> I fell for that one. That's funny. Yep. I think it's fucking hilarious. Yeah, oh. going. Ha 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 ha. It was all right. Yeah, it was okay. Help me help on, you. Guys. I don't want to be here. You don't want me here. The sooner you answer my questions, the sooner I'll be out of your. I, I swear if it's the woodsman, I'm gonna, I fuck, I fucking called it. I fucking knew it. They're both lying. They're both fucking lying. Uh. Fucking called it. That bitch ass liar, dude. Ollie, you're out of paper towels in the... What's up? What's up? What's up? I I'm looking for you. I ain't gonna hurt you. I just wanna talk. I just wanna talk. That's it. I just... I just wanna fucking talk. Don't cause any problems for me. Number one or number two? For your sake, uh, I hope it was two. Otherwise, you're probably shitting your pants right now. Damn. You and me have been going at it for hundreds of years. No pillow fights. That makes two of us. Well, Woody, that makes two of us. Okay. You're in luck. I decided to switch seats. Mm hmm. I just want to talk. I just want to talk. This doesn't have to go like this. That's it. I just want to fucking talk. Maybe he don't want to talk to you. Why don't we let him tell me that? Okay, Greg. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. He ain't nobody's bitch, Grin. He ain't nobody's bitch. I just want to talk. Talk to him about shit. Funny. 
Just a minute ago, no one seemed to know who you were. Yeah, well, everyone knows you. Big bad wolf. <laughs> no, I'm the bad guy and you're a sheriff. Come on, Woody. You know why I'm here. You want to know what happened? Amongst other things, sure. <laughs> it's funny. The shit you're willing to do for money. I'd walk past her place for weeks. Didn't look like it. She had money. I was sure of it. And she wouldn't put up any kind of fight. Finally get up the nerve to do it. There you are. Fucking things up for me. You were just in the wrong place at the wrong time. So it was, was a robber? A saver. So you were planning on robbing her? Yeah. Her and her grandma. Grandma? Wait, what are you talking about? Red Riding Hood. Her grandmother. That's her grandmother, Red Riding Hood? Rob them. But when I showed up, you were already there. Lying in the bed. I only saved her because I thought she might give me a reward. She didn't give me shit. Except a bunch of people thinking I'm something I ain't. And I played along as long as I could. Only thing I managed to get from it was a free drink every now and again. <laughs> Not a good that did. Hey, stop! This isn't what I want. Oh, shut the fuck up, Woody. Shit ain't just about you. It's about this fucking lapdog. Hey, man, I'm not. Part of town when the rich fucks in the woodlands need a shakedown. Ain't that right, Bigby? Lapdog? Really? Yeah, really? My sister goes missing. No one gives two shits about her. Paperwork. Waiting rooms and that bitch Snow White looking right past me, then ushering me out the fucking door. Anyone tell you you got a big fucking mouth? Oh, it gets bigger. Yeah. Oh, good. What the fuck? Should have walked out of here when you had the chance. Oh, you're scaring the lady. Don't worry about me. <laughs> what the fuck? Kind of fairy tale Twilight type shit is this? All right, I guess we're fine. I wanted to take this calm. Uh, I want to do this shit calm. All right. I mean, that's fucking shit. I wanted to do this shit coming. You're not. You have been such a bitch. Fuck you. And your fucking monkey ass looking ass. Shit. <laughs> that didn't do shit. I just got bitch slapped. Fuck me. Ooh. I'm too good at dodging. Stab him. Yep, there you go. Fuck. I'm just his fucking play toy. I'm literally a toy. Oh, I'm pissed off. Come here, motherfucker. Oh, get him. Fucking bitch. You 
done? He's had enough. Fuck that, I'm not turning his arm off. I'm not tearing his arm off, fuck that. He had enough. I stabbed him, fucking scratched his face, neck, stabbed him. Whiskey. Double it. Uh, yeah, yeah. So you don't want to say shit now that I'm a big bad werewolf, huh? Shit. It's not like you were going to pay for it anyway. I wanted to pay for it. Don't even think about it. Is this the type of treatment I can expect if I let you take me in? I'm not going to take you in. Hey, he started it. He did start it. He literally fucking started that shit. All right. I got a hundred bucks for the first bloke that can tell me something about a girl name. Oh, hey. I ain't gonna do shit. Alright. Unless you pull some shit. God. Fuck. The woodsman. She knows something about the girl. I have to let him go. The woodsman probably ain't do shit. He just went there. Necessary. Shit. He's the one you want, not me. Your brother won't be saving you this time. Come on. You're under arrest. I told you I didn't do it. And you got nothing to worry about. Okay, the only reason I went after him is because them them motherfuckers bitch slapped me. Now that I don't take. Here's the thing. Woodsman, he was just there to rob them. He wasn't going to do shit. That's why I arrested the twin. Fuck. Oh, but he could have, the woodsman could have told me more. God damn it. <sighs> Fuck me. Fuck it, we'll live with it. Made my choice. <sighs> Anything stupid, and I'll throw you down the witching well myself. Fuck happened. Another fucking crime happened, robbery, shootout, or some shit. What the fuck happened? They killed fucking snow? What we the fuck? Very special. Where's your brother? Fuck you. Give me one good reason I should tell you anything. 
serial killer. Oh, oh my. A serial killer? Oh God, if it's one of us. Wait, the woodsman's still walking the streets. We've got to put a lid on this. If we can't manage it, I'll find someone who can. I found out where she's been staying. I know she's here. You must have seen her. What are the two of you hiding? Thanks, but I'm not saying anything. Of course. It doesn't matter. Maybe we just want so to he is a pimp. We can arrange that. What did you do? Uh, friend on friend. At the end of the end. Friend on friend. At the end of the end. Jesus Christ, Big B. Is that you? The Wolf Among Us, episode 2, Smoke on Mirrors, premiering on the next video. Damn. That was a good first fucking episode. Did you give faith your money? You and 84% of players gave faith your money. Yep. Did you tell Beast the truth about Buddy? You and 59% of players lied and said you have, hadn't seen Beauty. Where did you decide to go? You and 69% two players went to help Todd. Of course. Todd needed help. You did not prevent Lawrence's death. Fuck me. Yeah. Prime suspect was the pimp. Not these guys. Apparently. Who did you arrest? When it came down to the wire, you and 68% of players made sure Twiddle D didn't get away. Yeah, man. It was just fucking. Like, damn. Okay. Well then. I hope you guys enjoyed this first episode of The Wolf Among Us. If you did, be sure to hit the like button and uh, be sure to hit the subscribe button. I will be posting more of this later on. And yeah. So yeah. Remember, be sure to subscribe if you haven't. Hit the like button and yeah. I hope I will see you in the next video. And I hope all of you have a beautiful and amazing day. See you in the next one, guys. Bye.